the book, I define heroism as commitment to personal development. It's no longer about changing the world, making a difference for your community or society. That's well and good, but so few people are given the chance to do that, isn't it so? So swear na lang sila, they'll be called a hero. But right now, it takes a heroic act for someone to commit to themselves. It takes a heroic act for you to say, I know people have needs, but then there are many things that I still have to change and improve about the way I think, the way I feel, the way I act. And I'm going to do that first before I tend to other people's needs. Or at the very least, make sure in the calendar that I'm prioritizing my growth and not just the needs of other people. Okay? That's why in the book I discuss heroism as your commitment to yourself, your commitment to your growth, your commitment to understanding the things that still have to be unlearned, relearned. Because as you know, there are many things you probably thought in the past were true, and then you grow a little bit. Sometimes it takes a week, sometimes it takes months, sometimes it takes years, and you realize, yung akala ko pala before was not true. It's okay. It's okay to have realizations like that. In fact, we embrace it. 